30, 60, 90 degree theorem. Statement. If the acute angles of a right angle triangle have measures 30 degree and 60 degree, then the length of the side opposite to 30 degree angle is half the length of the hypotenuse. Given in triangle ABC, angle B is equal to 90 degree, angle C is equal to 30 degree, and angle A is equal to 60 degree. What we have to prove is the side opposite to 30 degree angle. This is a 30 degree angle. Side opposite to 30 degree angle is AB. Is half the length of the hypotenuse. So AB is equal to half of the hypotenuse. That means AB is equal to half of AC. This we have to prove. For this we have to do the construction. Take a point D on the extended segment AB. Such that AB is equal to BD. Draw segment DC. Here segment DC is drawn. Proof. In triangle ABC and in triangle DBC. Segment AB congruent to segment DB. That is construction. Angle ABC congruent to angle DBC which is of 90 degree. Segment BC congruent to segment BC which is a common side. Therefore, triangle ABC congruent to triangle DBC by SAS test. Therefore, angle BAC congruent to angle BDC which is a corresponding angles of congruent triangles. Now, in triangle ABC, angle BAC is equal to 60 degree. Therefore, angle BDC is equal to 60 degree. Angle BAC is of 60 degree. Therefore, angle BDC is of 60 degree. Therefore, angle DAC is equal to angle ADC is equal to angle ACD is equal to 60 degree. Since sum of the angles of triangle ADC is 180 degree. Therefore, triangle ADC is an equilateral triangle. So, all the angles of this angle uh, triangle are of 60 degree. Therefore, AC is equal to AD is equal to DC. Reason corollary of converse of isosceles triangle theorem. But from the construction, we know that AB is equal to half of AD. Therefore, AB is equal to one half of AC. Since AD is equal to AC.